My name is Vicar Lar, and this is your 30 minute lower body hit cardio and core class. Let's get it. Before we get started, I just want to give a quick shout out to two women that have just joined my Every Girl Transformation Bootcamp, Grace and Samantha. I'm so excited to work with you guys. If you're interested in joining and you want to see what it's all about, the link is below, so go and check it out. We're going to get right into this workout. This workout is a lower body workout, but it's definitely different than what I usually do for my lower body classes. We have a setup that we're just running straight through. We're going to have a lift for a 50 second effort. We're gonna have a Tabata effort, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, running through it twice. Back to that same lift that we did before. That's the setup, we'll have a core movement and that's the setup. We run through, all the way through. And so we're 30 minutes into this workout and we finish it nice and strong. You'll understand the setup as we go, but you're gonna need medium to heavy weights. We're gonna get started right now. We have to start a stiff leg deadlift for 50 seconds. You're gonna have a slight bend in your knee. Palms are facing you. You're coming down, shifting the hips back, coming up, squeezing the glutes. I am using 20 pound dumbbells. So again, if you have heavy dumbbells, grab them. If you don't, that's totally fine. Our cardio efforts are gonna be intense. This is gonna be a high intensity class, so just get ready for it. We're gonna get going though. In five seconds. In three, two, one. We have that stiff leg deadlift. We're here for 50 seconds. We'll have 10 seconds to rest and transition. I will show you what's coming next during that 10 second transition. Shifting those hips back until you feel a stretch in your hamstrings, then you're right back up. So remember, we have lift, cardio, lift, core. Repeat, that's the setup. Lift, cardio, lift, core. Lift, cardio, lift, core. Every lift that you do, you will do a total of two times. 10 seconds. Three, two, one. We have a jump hop lunge. So you're gonna jump. Okay, alternating, we're on for 20 seconds right now. Step it back, jump up. Step it back, jump up. We're here for 20 seconds. 10. Three, two, one, rest. 10 second rest, we go back and do it for 20. Whew, I love that little mid hop. It's a little bit easier than like switching all the way. We are on right now, step it back, hop forward, back, hop forward. We have five. Three, two, one. 10 seconds off right now. We're back into our stiff leg deadlift. In five, three, two, one. Stiff leg deadlift. Slow and controlled. A hip hinge is when those hips come back as you come down. That's a hip hinge. Pretend you have a string attached to your lower back and someone's pulling you back. We have 20 seconds. In 10 seconds, we're gonna take it to our first core movement. Three, two, one. We have a double crunch. You're on the ground, framing the knees and your back. Option, knees to chest. We are on right now. We're here for 50 seconds. You can let your heels touch the ground, by the way, in between each rep. And just get yourself ready to kind of shoot up. Make sure you're coming up with power. 
framing those knees and your back down. Twenty seconds here. You have five, three, two, one. Ten second rest. We have a back squat with tempo. Weights are on your upper back. Let them hang. You're gonna come down for three. Pause and shoot up for one. We are on right now. You're coming down nice and slow. Pause, up, squeeze the glutes. So now you know the setup. We have our back squat. We'll have our cardio, our back squat, and another core movement. 20 seconds. Final 10. Nice and slow. Give me that pause. You're up. Three, two, one. Drop your weights. We have suicides. So we're gonna tap the ground side to side. We're on for 20 seconds in three, two, one. Let's go. love this setup with this class. This is probably gonna be one of my favorites. We have five, three, two, one. Take a little breath. Woo. We're back on, let's go. Final 20 seconds with this movement. You have 10. Three, two, woo, one. We have our back squat coming up. We are on with our back squat. Final time you'll see this movement. So that tempo, you're just lowering down for three seconds, pausing for one, coming up for one. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, one, weights down. We have our core movement. We have a power sit up with a twist. Heels are in the floor. Come up, opposite knee to opposite elbow. And you're alternating. We are on in five. Three, two, one, let's go. Forceful exhale as you come up. It just forces your core to flex even more. You're doing great. Fifteen seconds. Three, two, one. Stand it up. We have a static lunge, working the right leg. You have the option to hold one weight up by the chest or two by your side. Right leg is going to be in front. You're coming down and up. We are on. I'm gonna hold one weight in front of me. And just focus more on my form here. So you're down, you're up.
all that weight is on that right foot. Twenty seconds. Three, two, one, drop that weight. Woo, we have high knees. Knees coming up. You're giving me 10 out of 10 effort. We're on in three, two, one, let's go. If you can, take it up a notch. We got 10. Three, two, one, yes. 10 seconds. I gotta get a new mic pack. We're on in three, two, one, let's go. Static lunge. We're back to it. Left leg. We're on in five. Three, two, one. Let's go. When you're doing your lifting efforts, we're focused on form. So if you're moving a little slower, that's fine. I don't care. As long as your reps are quality. 20 seconds. Final 10. Three, two, one. Drop your weight. We have alternating single leg V-ups. You're coming up, framing that leg. We are on right now. Stay with me. We have 20. 20 seconds is nothing. You're stronger than 20 seconds. Stay with me. Five. You're still repping it, repping it out. Time. Next movement. We have knee ups. So you're holding one weight. You're starting from the knees. You're gonna step it up with the right leg, step it down with the left leg, and alternate. You are on. So whatever leg you step up with is the last leg to come back down to the floor. Because as you step down, that working leg is still working. Left leg you're stepping up with, back down with the right, then the left. Right, left, left, right. seconds. Five, three, two, one. We have speed skaters. You're jumping into one side, staying nice and low, back and forth. We're on. In three, two, one. Let's go. This effort is a little bit more about balance and control. We have three, two, one, rest. 10 second rest. Woo. 
We're on in three, two, one, let's go. We're halfway through this workout. You're killing it. 10. Three, two, one. We're taking it back to those knee ups. Holding that weight in front of your chest. We're on in five, three, two, one. Step it up. That working leg is still working. Now you switch. is pouring down my face. Exactly what I'm looking for. 20 seconds. Three, two, one, drop your weight. We have bicycle crunches. Just a basic bicycle crunch, opposite knee. To opposite elbow, I want you to fully twist. You're on in three, two, one, let's go. Take breaks as you need. Give me a nice pause in between each rep. 30 seconds. Three, two, one, you're up. Whew. We have front squat with a tempo. So both weights are in front of you or just one. You're in your squat stance. Toes are slightly pointed out. You're coming down, pausing just like before and back up. You are on right now. Front squat, same thing as a back squat, but just a little bit more quad dominant. So you're working your front, front of you, back squats a little bit more of your posterior chain. Nice and slow. And you're up. Ten seconds. Three, two, one, drop your weight. Cardio movement. Don't hate me, but we gotta jump squat. You're down, you're up. We're going for 20 seconds in five. Three, two, one, let's go. Five, three, two, one, rest. Whoo, you're killing it. Five seconds, we're back on. In three, two, one, let's go. Ten. Three. Two, one. Grabbing your weight, we're back down into that front squat. In five, three, two, one. Let's go. This is your last, second to last, 50 second effort. We have core coming up and then things are changing. So let's make a count. Three, 
15. Three, two, one, drop your weight. We're coming down to the ground. We have toe touches. Legs are in the air. Reach for those toes. We're on in five, three, two, one. Get that upper back off the ground, hold, and come back down. Really reach, really give yourself that time and pause and then come back down. 20 seconds. So right, so right, so right. I'm just going with the gut. Never had a doubt, felt like this is just a must. Put me in perspective, I'm the deepest in the three. Everybody tune in here. Two. This is just for us. One. Awesome job. Things are changing. All right. We are done with our longer efforts. We have power rounds coming up. Every single effort we have is 30 seconds, okay? It's all body weight, so no weights are involved here. You are on for this entire round straight through, okay? We're gonna start with a squat hold. I'm just gonna tell you what's coming as we get to the end of our effort. There is no transition time. We are back to back here, okay? Weights are on the ground. You're welcome. We're gonna start with a 30 second squat hold. You're on in three, two, one. You're holding that squat. These 30 second efforts involve legs, cardio, and core. You're just holding that squat. In 15 seconds, we're gonna take it to an alternating reverse lunge. If you don't know what that looks like, you'll see when it comes. You have five, three, two, one. Stand it up, take it back. You are alternating with that reverse lunge. Fifteen seconds. We're taking it to a thirty-second low plank. Five, three, two, one. You're down on the ground, low plank, holding for 30. Stay up. Fifteen seconds. We're taking it to a basic crunch. Three, two, one. You're on your back. You're giving me that crunch. You're not pulling by the neck. You're using that core. Fifteen seconds. We will take it to a sumo squat hold. So it's just a wide stand squat. Five, three, two, one. Stand it up. Wide stance. Hold. Knees are pointed outward. Fifteen seconds. We have a squat jack. Okay. We're going in three. Two, one, let's go. Squat jack for 30. In 10 seconds, we're taking it to a high plank hold. Speed it up, come on. You have five, three, two, one. Down into that high plank, you're holding it here. 
control your breath. Fifteen seconds. We are taking it to knees to chest. So you're staying on the ground. Three, two, one. Get back on your butt. Knees to chest. Let's go. We're here for 30. We're going to take it to a static lunge hold in five. Three, two, one, stand it up. Step the right leg back and hold. You're holding here. All that weight is in the front leg. In 15 seconds, you're gonna take it to a curtsy lunge. Working that same leg. You're stepping back just like a reverse lunge, except you're coming a little bit diagonal and knees will align. In three, two, one, step it back and forward. So you're coming back diagonally, my knees are aligning, and you're forward. You're at the home stretch of this workout, four minutes or less here of work in three, two, one, you are holding the other side. So that right leg. Woo. Holding. You're gonna take it to a curtsy lunge in five. Three, two, one, let's go. Fifteen seconds. We'll take it down to the ground and hold six inches. I'll show you what that is when we get there. Or you're lying on your back. In three, two, one. On your back, holding your legs six inches off the ground. If you need to tuck your hands under your hips, please do. And if you have to drop your feet, that's fine. Just get back up when you can. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. You're taking it to a crunch. We already did this. Crunches for 30. Second to last movement. Make sure you're squeezing that core. Exaggerate it. Final five. Three, two, one. Stand it up. Awesome job. In 10 seconds, we're getting into high knees for two efforts, 20 second efforts. This is your last effort. All right, you're gonna empty that tank. We're on in three, two, one. Get those knees up. 20 seconds here. Final minute. That's all we have. 10, speed it up. Three, two, one. Rest for 10. You're on. Final 20 seconds of work. Let's go. Pump your arms. You have 10. Three, two, one. Whew. Awesome job. I loved that workout. Like I really did. Whew. I hope you had 
an amazing experience working out with me today. You killed it. You worked hard and you should feel extremely proud. If you're interested in my Every Girl Transformation Bootcamp, link is below. If you like this video, go ahead and like it. And if you haven't subscribed, it would mean the world. I hope you come back and work out with me again. Have an amazing day.